Aquarius, welcome back to another edition of Saturday Night Cocktails. You already know what we do. We pick a drink, we make it together, we try it together, and most importantly, we talk shit and get lit! <laughs> and every episode I have a special guest, and today my special guest is my friend Stephanie. Hi! Welcome! <laughs> so Stephanie, please tell us about yourself and about your t-shirt business. Sure. So I'm really into uh, graphic designing and I started a shop called Careless uh, that is mainly featuring Disney horror graphic designs, but hopefully it can eventually grow into more. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so where mm -hmm. can we find you on social media? Sure, you can find us at Careless Shop um, on Instagram and Etsy. Okay, you guys better check it out. <laughs> yes. All right, so today is really special because it is the third anniversary of Saturday Night Cocktails. Yay. Hey! <laughs> I cannot believe it. Time is flying when you're having fun. A little too much fun. So we're going to do something a little bit different. We will be making a spicy jalapeno margarita and we'll be doing two variations. So Stephanie will be making it with tequila. Yes, I'll be making it with tequila substitute, which is not alcoholic so that everyone has an opportunity to follow along with us. That's that. I'm excited. Yeah, so my ready yeah. to drink. So, of course, you have to do the honors. My favorite step, mm -hmm. which is the tequila. Yes. So we're going to need a lot step. of that. So we need half, a half cup of tequila. Okay. All right. Yes. And so while you do that, I will ask our first question. <laughs> okay. Okay. So if there was anything that you could change about yourself, what would it be? So I feel like the one thing that I would for sure want to change about myself is my eyebrows. <laughs> um, thank God for makeup. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. <laughs> um, my eyebrows are small and compared to my sister, she has like full on brows. She doesn't have to fill them in. Mm -hmm. She doesn't even have to pluck them. They look good. <laughs> and I wish I was blessed with that. So if you see this, whatever. <laughs> my sister. But um, yeah, I wish they were just more fuller. But thank mm -hmm. God for makeup. <laughs> well, <laughs> um, <laughs> personally, think uh -huh. your brows are snatched. Thank you. I was checking them out. Yeah. I was like, yeah. <laughs> thank you. Yeah. <laughs> appreciate it <laughs> um i would say probably my height um yeah. i'm definitely amazon queen over here you are a stallion but i just feel like if i was a little bit shorter maybe like five seven i'd be more comfortable in heels I and see. i wouldn't feel like a linebacker you know Stop. <laughs> walking down the street <laughs> did this robin vibes like <laughs> i don't know no not at all like i'm yeah, I'm not in that phase where I'm like, oh, I hate being tall. Like, I definitely love it and appreciate it, but just like a little bit shorter. I see. Just for like the versatility. Okay, yeah. gotcha. <laughs> You're beautiful though. Thank you. Love Thank stallions. You. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you have poured the tequila. We got the best part ready. Now I will queue up a few limes for us. We need a half cup of lime juice. So I'll start on this. And thank you. Mm -hmm. And then we can go into our second question. Okay. So, if you were stranded on a deserted island with anyone, yes, who would you be stranded with? Jason Momoa, hands down, Aquaman, <laughs> A.K.A. him and Lisa Bonet just got like a divorce. He is single. <laughs> Sorry, boyfriend of mine. But him because I don't know social media you know okay um he is very like he's from hawaii so obviously you know he's got that like islander vibe and to me his like whole look on the world is just trying to be like uh what is it more natural with his resources so i feel like he would be he would be the best person to be deserted on an island with mm, okay and he looks great too so. that's what i was gonna say like yeah. you got the best of both worlds oh like, yeah definitely he can help you out he can help you out <laughs> and you can um, like my answer mm -hmm. probably like of course i want to go with someone who i can like laugh with who be like this is kind of cool we can yeah. build our own civilization mm -hmm. someone who i like want to make babies with as well <laughs> in case we're stuck stuck and we have to like populate the place yeah um but you know i think the novelty would wear off pretty fast and i would want to get off the island uh -huh. So I think I need to be with someone who can get me off the island. So I was thinking like a producer of Survivor. 
You know, that is a very, like, like, logical way. Yeah. Like, the producer of Survivor or Naked and Afraid, I feel like there's probably some hot guy on, on, on the roster that knows how to build shit out of leaves. <laughs> but this is, like, deserted island, you know? It's more of, like, there's no cameras, or at least that's what I'm thinking. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need a camera. I just need to know how to get back home, you know? Like, He's gonna be like, look, here's a script, like, here's ideas of how we can, like, start a fire. Yeah. Yeah, that's my answer. But if I have to go with my, like, you know, fun, mm -hmm. fun, fun times answer, probably my boyfriend. Oh my yeah. gosh, you guys are so cute. <laughs>
So before we try our drinks, we're actually going to take a shot of the non-alcoholic tequila because I'm just really curious to your opinion. Me too. So it's going to be weird. But let's we have these shot glasses that are authentically from Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> we're from Puerto. What is it? Vallarta? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Charlotte Valle. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Oh wait, we go down. Right? Yeah. Oh. Whoa, that was kind of weird. It tastes like a really, really light, like the lightest tequila ever. It's okay. It's a little satisfying. <laughs> okay. Because it still has that spice to it, which is why it I like has it. an aftertaste of tequila. But my brain is like, where's the tequila? <laughs> <That's true. laughs> you. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Yeah. Not, not too bad. Not too bad. Mm -hmm. All right. So we're gonna try our drinks. They probably taste a lot different. Yeah. And so then after we try them, then we mm -hmm. should rate them from one to five. Okay. You ready? Yes. All right. Saturday night cocktails, baby. Cheers. Third anniversary. Woo. Cheers. Cheers. Okay, this two. <laughs> oh, Jesus. My God. Girl. That oh, is good. Lord. What? That is really good. We missed something. On yours? We had to. Mine tastes deep. Okay, I would All say I try mine, but... is like salt. <laughs> you? But we didn't even put salt in it. And it's just so There's no sour. sugar in this. But we use honey, so like I don't know why it's so salty. Maybe it wasn't enough honey. It's the raw honey, right? Mm -hmm. But that still has some mm -hmm. sweetness. Um, so what would you rate it from a one to five? I would honestly give it at least a three. It's not my favorite, okay. Right? But um, I feel like it's missing more of maybe more of the proportions mm -hmm. and balance between. I guess you could say yeah, the sweetness, okay, and the jalapeno lime. I think okay. lime is a big thing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. This is not good. I'm giving this. <laughs> I am so sad to announce on my third anniversary Saturday Night Cocktails episode that this is a 1.5. Like, we're going back to original, like, this is a full circle moment, because uh -huh. I rated my Paloma on my first episode a 1.5. We are tasting our... Well, all scared, to be honest with you. I have a soap, so this is, just looks like a lot of tequila. So, Saturday Night Cocktails! Saturday Night Cocktails, let's Cheers. see. Oh. <laughs> Did you really? Yeah, it was bad. So <gasps> this is pretty damn bad. Oh. So everyone at home, as you watch this, I'm gonna suggest that you add more honey and make it just a little bit sweeter. Mine is good. <laughs> <laughs> to me, mine is really good. <laughs> All right, everyone. We're at the end of our episode, Saturday Night Cocktails, third anniversary. Woo! Thank you, Stephanie, for joining me. It has been so fun. Yes, thank you for having me. <laughs> uh, tell us again where we can find you on social media. Yes, you can find me on Instagram at Careless Shop and same with Etsy. All right, check it out. Yes. And as always, I'm Asia the Aquarius, baby. I'll be back next time. Saturday Night Cocktails. Woo, cheers. cheers. <laughs>